Hey guys, Tech Experts here with another Photoshop tutorial. This time, the tutorial is going to be on importing photos. This was requested by my friend Shock Shaxbodzam. And um, yeah, so let's get started. First thing you're obviously going to do is open up Photoshop. You can take a nap. Okay, now you, now, you, now you have to wake up. Okay, so importing images. So we're going to just do a 1280 by 720. You can, this is just a test. You can do it to any size, any thing you want. This is going to be a basic, basic tutorial. Okay, you're going to double click that to unlock it. Background, I just like to unlock it so I can edit it. Anywho, so now that you got your back, I'm going to create a backdrop. So we're going to just do gradient overlay. Change the style to radial. And reverse it. Move up the scale to 150%. And we're going to change this to a light gray. There, oh, that's perfect. So you can see the backdrop I like to use this for everything so the next thing we're gonna do is you're gonna go find your image so I'm already in my graphics and uh, let's see what we want let's do uh, hmm. actually let's do well one sec guys, let me just find what I'm looking for. Uh this will do. Alright, so you got this right. And so this is imported from Cinema 4D, so your image has been imported. Now to move it to there, you're just gonna drag and drop. Easy as that. But as you can see, it's kind of big, and you know the black background is there. So to get rid of the black background, what you're going to do is you're going to click and hold the eraser tool, and click Magic Eraser Tool. And uh, now what this does is it erases everything that's like it. So um, it's not good if you have like a black, like if this outer layer was black of the text, it would erase that text part. So it's good to have a difference in background color so it doesn't happen. So you're just gonna click that and see how it erased all the black. So now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go between the text and get rid of the black between there. Okay. Alright, so now that that part's done, so now we in order to resize it, you push Control. Actually, get, you put your pointer tool on, and then you press Control or Command T. I don't know if this works. Okay, yeah, there it goes. It was just too big. Anyway, now to fix this, you just drag, press Shift and hold to keep it in aspect. Apply changes move it back up and you see that only removed that because that was in the scene it didn't do anything else because it was out of scene so you gotta do it again pretty easy now I'm gonna zoom in up here just double click and then I'm gonna do that to a hundred okay so now there's more black stuff to do so you just do the process over again to you have all the black removed Okay, there you go, there you go. And there you go. Okay. So I'm going to zoom back out so I can see everything. Let's do 80%. Alright. So I'm going to select this again. Alright, so there's your image. It has been imported. Now you can edit the image. You can just do blending options and you can do a drop shadow. You can do an inner shadow. You can do 
just whatever you want. On text like this, I like to do outer glows. So there's outer glow. So since the backdrop is white, all I'm going to do a black or a dark gray. Okay. Change that to normal because screen basically just does whatever is in the background. It doesn't really do anything. So you change that to normal. And then I'm going to raise the opacity all the way up so it's full color. And there you go. That's how you import an image into Photoshop and drag it onto your or just basically import a thing into Photoshop. This has been Tech Experts with another basic Photoshop tutorial. Um, and next weekend, by the way, guys, I am going to be, or actually this Friday, this Friday, yep, I'm going to be creating a graphics pack and uploading that so that we have all of my preset stuff. It'll have some pre made backgrounds that you guys can have. And uh, it'll have like patterns, you know, fonts stock images, flares, all that kind of stuff for you guys to download. So this has been Tech Experts with a basic Photoshop tutorial. Have a nice day.